Just wait, is what we do. <laughs> Today's video is going to be about adversity. Overcome things, because I'll tell you what. 7.30 now, we're just about to put out lines. We blew out a hub first thing this morning. Blew out a hub first thing this morning on the trailer. Kind of a few miles from my house, I heard it go. Good thing we had spare hub with us. We changed it all out. A little bit of delay on game on that. We had to put fuel this morning. Gas station is closed. We went somewhere else to put fuel. It's about, all about overcoming. It's a late day. We're about two hours behind our normal schedule. What we're going to do is uh, sit up now, get lines out, and hope for the best. You know what I mean? Only be positive. All about positive vibes. But fish with me today is the one and only Ninja Henry. I'm back. So that's going to be good. Check out the shirts, warnstores.com. We have our new Real Adventure shirts in. Pretty epic, good stuff. And. To change the luck around, I know it's gonna happen. It's gonna be good today. We have the one and only Yardstone Rye. Well, how many hats do we have today? What's the over under for losing your hat today? 50 uh, 50. 50 50? I don't know about that, Henry. <laughs> the wind is gonna be blowing today. It's gonna be rough. It's not too bad right now. I think it's about a 90. I think it's 50 50. No way. I give it a 95% chance. <laughs> is he going to lose it today. now or is he going to lose it later? Oh, he's going to lose it eventually. <laughs> uh, but Harry's going to put a nice ice blue. We have to reskirt it. Oh no, demolished it. Uh, but you guys know the rules. Any good fishing trip, if you got to get something, you have to give something. I'll tell you what. That sea guy loves his spam to bees. Let's get the spam to be in the water. Supposedly, guys found Otaru yesterday. Giant skip jack over 20 pounds. We're gonna see if we can find them. There's some tuna fish here and there. See if we can find something. Let's just get some fish in a boat and uh, see what happens. Get the lines out and we'll be back shortly, everybody. 8.15 in the morning. Never we'll we found ourselves a bird pile. Real surprised thing has lucky hat on. See what happens. Let's see it, boys. Angrels, angrels. You get lucky. Hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe. If you hit the thumbs up, we might get whacked right here, walking through them, we'll see. Hopefully it's with all those. It's on, right, Henry? It's on, yeah. Yeah, it looks on. Yeah, look at the ringer bend, it's on. Oh. I didn't ice blue. That's a Apu, that's a Wataru. That pile's went off, let's get reset real fast. I guess we'll leave the 9 out for now, huh, Henry? So. All right, that's one. We'll take it. We'll take it. Low wash. I would say it's an early morning workout, but it's pretty late already. There you go. Always on there. Yep, yeah, always on there. Yeah. Once his head's up, once his head's up, get him. Once his head's up, you gotta get him. You can't have swim on you. When his head's up, you gotta keep his head up. Don't let him dip back down like that. Good job. Look like this guy healed up from a cookie cutter bite. There. Beautiful fish. Gonna make a lot of people happy. What? Oh boy. A lot of ice. Hopefully we get something bigger than these guys, but you know what? This is already a great day. Two paddles so far. Not slow, not the multiples. Not gonna get the weight by getting single, those multiples. Double, double, triple, 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 triple. Come on, baby, four bigger. Four, rigor on, nice rigor on, four on. Huh? What came off? Yeah, you. Wow. 
To the five banger, one came off the run, so there's four left. Henry lost one at the boat. We lost one more, I guess, on the run. But we gained two on that path, so. Four Otaru's, get back to the pocket, everybody sit back up. Put out the nine inch ice blue, because the nine inch ice blue lost one too. It was on for a while, but it came off. Put a six inch bullet. Hopefully, get a little bit of better sticking action on it. We switched out one nine inch lure for a six inch bullet. We're going for Otaru's, increase our chances. Oh, on. Double. Oh, came off. Playing super hard. There it is. Oh, that's a dozer, Henry. That took me forever. I gotta start working out. My dad always says, when the rain comes, it's just a blessing. Come on to be good. The rain is here. Let's see what happens. Five Otaru so far. We've got about 100 pounds of fish so far. Easily over 100. All upper 20 size Otaru. So, see what happens. 925 in the morning. Work your way back to the pile. You're about to get some raindrops. Let's get them, boys and girls. Hit the thumbs up if you haven't already. Hit the subscribe. We'll do videos every Friday. Here we go. Let's see the fireworks. Double. Make sure it comes in even. Your crisscross, yeah. Nick, you want to help him out? Mine's coming up already. Yeah. Seven. Seven. Good job, boys. Big ones. Take it. We'll take it. Put it right on top. And we can break another bag after. These are some butter balls, man. What? Some nice fatties. Got a charitable right here that's on, boom boom. Charitable from Wine Eye. My friend Joe them. They're on the meat right now with their crew, which is good. Yeah. They're on. Double. This side them. Oh, that's really big though, but still, yeah, it shouldn't have full line like that. Oh, it's look at that claw hook. Look how big it is. It, it hooked on the top of his head. Oh, that's why. This claw hook. That's why. Well, false to line. We thought something better, but that's why it's like so hard, Henry. It's hooked on the top of his head. <laughs> that's what it was. All right, so that's nine. Doing those numbers slowly. Definitely over 200 pounds. Let's see what happens. All right, sit back up, go again. All right, so that passes the bird, just sit back up, see what happens. Rigger's on up, rigger's on, rigger's on. Get that right. Get that. Nice. Perfect hook set. That's right, nice one. Good job, right? Well, that's another dozer. That's 10. Now we double digits. Perfect. Now we try to get 11. 
10 for 10.30. Gotta love it. Sleep more down. It's so almost 11 o'clock now. Got a bird pond in front of us. Big day, so bird pounds are gonna be the greatest. They're not gonna stay up for a long time. Hey, where are we, sorry, I don't know. Maybe not. Double. Other. Other quarter. That's a dozer. Well, I got here to like you mine. Yeah, you good job, right? The point of six inch bullet is good, huh? Good. This will be the pass. This will be the pass. Come right now. Ooh, that bird goes so deep. Yeah, we were under the boat. You saw how deep it went? The bird? <laughs> you went underneath the boat, right? Yeah. Okay, cross here. Oh, it's gonna be on the riggers. A long bite. It's gonna be a long bite. That's what you want. Swallow the boat, baby. One on. One on. Only one. Ah, they're too far back on this bit. Oh, fireworks. Two on. Three on. Three on. Yes, sir. Three on. Came off. Some days they stick really good. Some days they don't stick really good. Today, a lot of them are not sticking at all. They bite, and I don't know what it is. Take a trip on that one. We literally turn the reel one crank and they come off. But we got one on still yet. We gotta start capitalizing, we gotta stop losing them, but can't help it sometimes. One more. Okay, right, it turns out I'm gonna turn to the starboard side. Perfect. Just, we're, we're at the pile, so. Okay. I get this question often, where do you get your fishing gear from? And a simple answer for me is highfishgear.com. I use raw five at checkout, I get 5% off, super fast, extremely fast shipping. I ordered this yesterday, it came in today. You can't beat it how fast these guys ship. Local Hawaii company ship all around the United States, all around the world, they ship to Guam. They keep a lot of stuff in stock that you can't find in other places. The best price on fluorocarbon leader line. If you wanna get those real adventures, lucky fishing hats, this is the place to do it. Check them out, links in the bow, links for all the stuff I use are also in the bow. Let's get a good pass on them now. You guys ready? Okay, let's get a pass on them. Up on! Ah, oh, come off! Gotta get those jackets on! There's a nice little rain squall coming that's gonna get us soaked. It's gonna come very shortly. Alright, let's go find the burns again. I'll leave you to your radar, you let your radar rub a bang. On, one on. So, two on. Got you. Hold on, hold on, Avery. Three on. Three on. Let's slow, huh? Four on. Oh, the kicker's not up on that one. Watch out for the bite in the line, Henry. I could not help you. I'll get her the bite. Oh, you guys feel about this four on? What do you guys think about the scenario right now? Oh, it's great. You guys are doing pretty good. I'm, I'm so proud of you guys right now.
Getting better, getting better. 16 on Taru Prong. Not bad. A little over 200 pounds of fish. Two o'clock in the afternoon. The place should start picking up. About five, five more hours of daylight left. See what can happen. They're looking for the fish right now. They're all spread looking for the fish, so we're gonna wait for them to come together. Right up there. And I wish you could see what I see right now, but they're all gonna come together right up here. We gotta speed up. Let's go. Let's get to them. That rain cloud passed after it passed. Everything woke up. Oh, back to it, guys. So, you got it. Yeah, well, not every. Nice one. We're 19 in the boat right now, and this pile's going off. The forecast is saying it's supposed to get 7 to 9 foot sea swell at 20 to 25 mile an hour winds in about an hour and a half. It's going to get sporty. Right now it's about a 5 foot sea swell with some bigger ones. I would say it's going to be like 15 to 18. So there we are. If we get a 7 to 9 foot sea swell, better pay attention. Let's see what happens. Getting the birds out. They're playing good. We're going to run four poles. We're going to do faster rotations. They're running so fast, I don't want to take six bangers. So, I'll be able to turn way more wild and crazy with four poles, so let's see what happens. But this power is going off. I got hundreds of Otaru surf right next to me. Look at this. Sometimes they don't bite when they surf, but let's see what happens. Wow, hundreds of them. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, we're on. I always like to keep my boat full of fuel so I have the weight. I like having the weight, especially when it's a little bit bumpier. And I don't have it full of fuel today because today's Easter and Castle is closed. So, though I'm not a bad dad, we celebrated Easter with my whole family yesterday. But my boat's lighter on fuel today. I'm about 500 gallons lighter than normal, so I prefer having the weight. Shut up, it's good. Up. Alright, see what happens. Congratulations, that is number 20 guys. You just hit the 400 pound mark. Congratulations. Alright, Paul's going off down there by the warship of course. Awesome. Nice one. Alright. Good water. 21. Good job. Alright, it's the hardest decision. This file is going off, but they're not biting. Otaru's is surfing. I don't really surf Otaru's and always bite Otaru's, but I had times where they went off. Today, not so much. Hundreds of them. That was good probably, and they're not biting. Probably five cylinder birds in this pile, and they are not biting. We got two fish in this pile somewhere, that's it. We're gonna run back in and see if we can find a better pile because it's four o'clock, we have two hours left. And we want a pile that's biting. This is the hardest decision to make. It's a leap of a pile to find a better pile. But decisions have to be made. It's up for the bite. All right, we're going to run in. Hopefully the gamble paid off. We left the other pile about 40 minutes ago. Kind of pushed on, pushing 12 knots, coming in. Trying to get some distance from the pile. Found another pile. It's all and they're up. Hopefully the gamble paid off and leaving that power was worth it. We're dealing with the other power for about an hour and we pulled two power on it. That was it. And there was hundreds of them surfing. We still only weighed four lines because it was so windy out there I couldn't make fast turns. So let's see if the gamble paid off. We'll know shortly. The first pass, we'll really know. Boiling! Look at this ride! Stop boiling! Hold on. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at that. Good lord. You guys are my heroes. 
Like, you guys are my heroes. Thank you, Lord. All right, let's get back in them. <laughs> yeah, you're 22. Oh, it's all the size, huh? Yeah. Oh. That'll do. Take that. That right there made it worth coming out way over here, Henry. Huh? That right there made it worth coming out way over here, just for that one. Yeah. 24 pieces because we did catch a rat that's in there now. Not bad for today for a late start. We definitely have some fish behind, but it's okay. Very enough. It's about a 500 pound day. Good job, Ninja Henry. Good job, yard sale. How come you didn't lose your hat today? He didn't give anything up. Dude, if he would lost his hat, I don't think we would have missed as much fish. <laughs> we have way more. Oh, yeah, we have way more. All right, uh, it's pretty good. Not too bad for a late start. What about the fish? He wants his fish from the sea. The water's too murky, too hard to see. And the farmer man.